Welcome home. I always felt like I had a giant tree standing next to me. And now that he's gone. This town, look at it. It's perfect on the outside, but underneath, there's a lot going on. People do not want that to change. You're not safe here. You're not. The house is trying to tell me something. If I were you, I'd leave this the hell alone. Why do I feel like he's controlling me from his grave? I always knew he loved you more than me. I thought you were different, your lad, but you all the same. I think we might have to look at changing your medication. <sighs> I'm not the liar. On the contrary, that's exactly what you are. You've made no progress. Zero. From your very first day here, accusing innocent people of rape. I mean, look at you. Who in their right mind would want to rape that? What are you going to do? What are you doing? The wound suggests something or someone very angry. Why do you say that? But our eyes. It's the fingers. Don't look. Don't touch. It feels personal, pathological. Sorry, so you're saying it's a person? No, I'm just saying it looks personal. No human could have made wounds like this. This, this is an animal. Something has torn open three of my goats from their throats yeah, yeah. to their assholes. It's a crocodile. Go, 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 please. Quiet, quiet. We need one meeting at a time. Thank you. Look, there have been many sightings, but you all can't seem to agree on what you saw. Okay, so, well, what else keeps dead meat in a lair underwater, eh, genius? No. It's not a crocodile. It's Mamblambo. I just need Sienna to believe it. I will not be blackmailed. <laughs> well, if you say a word of this to anyone, I've got five people that'll say that not only did you drug Yola, but you took part in the ritual with us. Please. Of life. Water is life. Only you.